Saturday morning and I'm already at the train station. I'm not going anywhere far, but um, I'm going on a park ride with my old manager. I kind of got into writing um, after she left and she was always kind of into writing, so we're gonna do her local park run and this might be my first 5k, let's see. Um, because I think the park run's 5k. Um, but yeah, if you don't know what a park run is, just like a group of people that gather at a park and go on a run together, um, usually in like a local area. I don't actually know if you can hear me, the announcement, but I'm gonna get on the train right now. to dinner this morning running was such a fail it was raining so hard we did try but it was just really coming down so no running this morning maybe tomorrow morning should we go on a run yes yeah, we can run to piccadilly circus <laughs> Good morning. It is Friday. I'm working from home today, but I'm actually gonna go work with a friend for half a day. I'm just at a cafe. I haven't done that in a while, so I'm kind of excited. Since I got promoted at work, I've been going in a lot more. Um, and yeah, it's tiring. <laughs> I think because like, I just gotten so used to working at home and then I'm more introverted, so the social battery is just real low lately. Today is my recharge day, but also it's kind of nice to get out of my house and do some different things. I'm using 
the Nude Stick Sun Kissed Blush. I quite like this color. But yeah, so I'm gonna go work from a cafe with her. And then I'm at, I'm gonna come home because I have to FaceTime uh, one of my best friends in Canada. We're planning a trip for our 30th birthday. Yes, I am almost 30. <laughs> um, I'm using this, I can't think of the word, the contour stick. This is actually all the makeup I usually use when I get ready to go to work on the tube. I started doing my makeup on the tube because it's just way more efficient and I just basically sit on, sit on the tube for a good like 30 minutes so I have a lot of time. Um, and I get on at the last stop, so I always get a seat, so it's never a risk of whether I can do my makeup or not. And then there's a lot of these, like, stick products that makes it really easy for me to do my makeup on the tube. So, this is, like, basically my base done. I don't really wear that much foundation anymore. And then, really, my eyes is where I put most of my effort. So, contour done. And then actually Marriott recently sent me some stuff, which has like been perfect for my little to-go makeup bag. Um, so I got this blush, not blush, um, it's a, sh a shadow pot. It's, it's an interesting texture. It's a cream, but it goes on and becomes a powder almost, so it doesn't crease. And basically I just like to add a bit of color to my lids because I'm doing it on the tube usually. I can't be precise with it. So it's just a bit of color. And then my brow is super simple as well. This, I'm using their brow gel, which has a bit of a tint to it. And it just kind of fills in where I need a bit of coverage. Like I have pretty thick brows. So it's mostly at the front when I, like I, can, I use this to define a few hairs. I really actually need to go somewhere and get my brows done. If you live in London and have a place you recommend for brows, let me know because I, I don't know where to go to get my brows done like I want someone to kind of reshape them honestly I then have this it's another I bought this in Hong Kong from the serum because they have like a little store there but I'll use a really thin brush can you see yeah I'll use a really thin brush and basically take a bit of the darker color and I'll just define my crease so I actually go above my eyeliner not eyeliner, eyeline, and just draw like a little wing, like you can kind of see it there. And then I'll connect it with like eyeliner at the bottom as well. And since I'm home and nothing is moving, I'm going to put on some eyeliner. <laughs> Voila. And then I'm going to put on this, this Chanel. Um, it went viral, I forget what it's called. It's like the, the bomb thing. Um, I've been really liking this actually. It just really adds like a really natural glow. Sometimes I'll wipe it on my face like this, but I find it, it sometimes picks up my blush. So I'll normally just like melt it a little bit on my hands and then tap it on my face. And it's just like a really natural highlight compared to I normally use like powder. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of mascara. I reuse my falsies, so I kind of just don't want to get them dirty with mascara. All right, I am done. Take out my hair. Blech. I honestly don't know what to do with my hair recently. I'm not loving it. <laughs> it's just, I think I need to darken my hair color again, just to match my roots a bit. I'm kind of over bleaching it now. Um, I say that, but who knows. Anyways, let me just get this hair sorted. Uh, Alright, let's get dressed to head out. Oh my god, spring is finally here, I think. <laughs> The cherry blossoms are out. I used to work around here and I totally forgot that this was a popular spot to watch the cherry blossoms.
possible. Yeah. 